my glasses on, unfortunately. I should have put that on. Yay, okay, so yeah, we have. I have, see a very good one. You see a very good one? Mm hmm. Yeah. Right there. I see a very good one right there. <laughs> what? Okay. That's a telescope. Oh, oh, oh. Can you see it? Yeah. So that we, means we don't science. Know it. Yeah, I know. It's really big. It's a lot bigger. Why do my. I see my. Why do I. bigger mounts, too. Why is there a drone on my socket? Do you want to do stockings first, I think? Sure. Okay, let's go ahead and do our stockings before we get into the bigger things. It says, oh, it's a whoopee cushion. Do you know what those are? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. when you step on it, it makes like a fart sound, I guess. Yes, that's what a whoopee cushion is. Okay. And you have, but you have to fold it up, I guess. Oh, I they're so tiny. Look at them, they're so cute. Little tiny drones. What's mine? Oh, I found my candy cane first. Yeah. I this is probably, this goes to something and I don't know what it goes to. Let's I find out what that goes to. Now there are several of them. Shapes. Oh, are these the little shapes from the museum? From the math museum? Oh, cool. Oh. There's several of them. Oh, I think these are shopping carts. Shopping carts? And I yes, also have, have like a giant thing right here. Here, it's three six sockets. Let's try more of these. The day the crayon came home. Mm -hmm. We did the one with the crayon it was actually blue, but him saying he said that he was red. So everyone thought he was red, but he was actually blue. And we also did the one one the crayon was quick. Mm -hmm. That's so the sequel. See, the crayons quit right there. They came back. And now they came back. Hey, Cooper, mm -hmm. look at Christmas Eve. Oh. Hey! Thank you. Thank you. Cooper, I didn't know that. Oh, my God! Is it a, how many what is it? it? Hundred. Oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you asked for a hundred dollars, right, Cooper? Did Christmas Eve give you a hundred dollars? Mm -hmm. I'm hanging mommy for that, that too. That's Santa. See, I, I'm hanging mommy too. Oh, oh. 
Santa I'm, brought you $100. And I'm thanking Mom for that. Why are you thanking Mommy? Because she got the Christmas Eve. Oh, because she got the Christmas Eve. <laughs> What is that? What number is that? A hundred. A hundred. What are you going to do with your hundred dollars, Cooper? Buy toys, I guess. Buy toys? What kind of toys? <coughs> um, the door alarm. Oh, the door alarm. Yeah, the yeah. spy gear door alarm? Mm -hmm. Hey, I know what you should do now. What? Why don't you open your shopping ornaments? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so before I open sock in series six, I'm opening ornaments. I'm gonna break these open. Oh, they're seafood. They're the first seafood ones I have ever got. Oh, those are cool. Oh, they're both Christmassy too. I got a Christmas tree and an ornament. And and these two who came from ornament. How did the tree come from ornament? Man, that this is just weird. Weird. That is kind of silly. How, how did an ornament break into an ornament? How do you get a tree in an ornament? Mm-hmm. We had an ornament on the tree that had a tree in an ornament in it. So, an uh, ornament on the tree broken open and, and you get another tree and it has an ornament inside. So this one. That's weird. weird. Ooh, a Christmas hatty. A what? A Christmas hat and a candy. Those are pretty cool. Yeah, they're all candy. Oh, whoa, I have books. I didn't notice these. Um, I have Hannah Hart's book, Buffering, uh, which I've actually, I'm very excited to read. And I also have Ashley's ABCs of LGBT. And then I have, ooh, a Japanese comic I love these. I got some, was it last year? Forever ago. I don't know. I still have some. And they're just really relaxing to color. And yeah, I didn't even notice that I had books because I was looking um, like in the stockings and paying attention to Cooper. But yay, I love these. Oh my gosh. I have a bigger book miss haul. Ha ha ha. I'm going to have so many books to read. I'm very excited about that. Wait. It's a rich child. <laughs> yes, I'm, I have 
weeks to go. So I'm only five years old. Old, old, old. I am the richest kid in the world. But I am hundred and I'm two twenties. Not us. Right here is all. This is my hall. which is a telescope, which I've been asking for. It is really, I, I can't see anything with it, obviously, right now, because it's morning, and it has a cover on it, and I'm inside. But yeah, it's so cool. Um, I need to look at it a little bit more to tell more about it, but I'm very excited to have a telescope because we've been looking at the sky using binoculars for the past, I don't know, when we started doing astronomy. Uh, but now we actually have a big, like a really big telescope on quite a large mount. Um, I don't have to look at it though, but electronic. Is this one of the tracker ones? Or, oh cool. Um, so is this, this is the mount that has, um, that like tells you where to point it, right? Oh cool, so this is a mount and it tells you where to point it. Like it doesn't immediately move the thing for you, but it tells you where you should point your telescope to be able to look at things. And I remember talking about how that's just a really good way to start looking at stuff through telescopes because it sort of says, hey, if you want to look at Venus, you gotta move it this way and then move it up a little bit and blah, 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 to look at that thing. And I'm re like really excited. I can't really express in words or tone of voice how excited I am to be able to look at the sky because this just opens a lot of different doors uh, to be able to, I'm twisting this around too much, okay. Um, a lot of different doors to be able to look at things and deep space objects that we couldn't see with our binoculars or with our naked eyes. Uh, I can't wait to take this out sometime and look at the sky through it. Um, we were probably gonna use it mostly in the backyard. But yeah, I'm just super excited to see what kind of clusters and deep space objects and stuff I can see with this. And I'm just really excited. Wait. Stand up right there. Okay. No, don't, don't drop, just slowly sit down. No, jump on it. Turn around, face mommy. Then, then, there you go, sit down, real slowly. Huh? Cooper! <laughs> Cooper! <laughs> so do not use the adjusting knob I'm on not, while you back I'm out. Oh, because it uses these. Yeah, you, you can break it from strip of yours. Okay, so that was a really amazing Christmas day. I actually have my favorite flavor of lollipop right here, which came in my stocking. Um, but yeah, it was really, That's really amazing. That's a candy. We That's just gave candy. the animals. I ate all That's a lot of candy. My, yes, I ate my whole candy cane already. Um, yeah, me too. Uh, but we just gave the animals their Christmas presents. Um, and that's our cat got a uh, catnip toy and he's kind of freaking out about it. And mm -hmm. my doggy he got, got uh, some, like this little kind of chewy thing. Got, and one of his old favorite toys that broke and got lost. Mm -hmm. He got a new Two version times, of it. Um, Two I believe. Leave. Twice, really? Yeah. Uh, but yeah, he, the uh, animals are really happy. But we have to take down the Christmas tree now um, because we're going out of town really soon. For two um, weeks. Yes, maybe, possibly. We don't know exactly yet. Uh, but we're going to be going out of town, but we'll talk about that tomorrow. But yeah, it's a really, really amazing um, Christmas day. I'm kind of sad. I think December 26th was one of the saddest days because it's sort of like Sunday at a con where like everyone's taking down their Christmas decorations and the whole, like December is like, it's Christmas. But now it's more just Christmas is over. We just did all that. Um, but yeah, I'm very, very excited. Uh, huge thanks to my parents for all of the stuff that we got for Christmas, as well as all of the people who have recommended books for Bookmas. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!